The effects of the drought have been felt throughout the state of Missouri. We can certainly see the toll it has taken on the environment. And farmers and livestock producers have taken a hit from the lack of rain. But what kind of effect is it having on the wine industry? LUTV's Jessica Hartman has the answer. Mount Pleasant Winery President Chuck Dressel has been in the industry for over 20 years and has never seen a drought like this. He says many people are surprised to find the lack of rain is a good thing for wineries. The drought actually improves the quality of the grapes. Because if you think about it, uh, grapes are composed of flavor chemicals, sugars, acids, and waters. And if the water portion is not there, that just means there's more flavor, more sugars, more acids. It just means the grapes are concentrated, so the quality goes way up. Because of the high quality this year, Dressel says consumers can expect a price increase. Although other factors like the economy, price of production, and the smaller harvest are also contributing factors. Uh, we didn't get as many grapes as we thought we were going to get, but it was pretty good. Even with the low number of grapes harvested this year, Mount Pleasant will produce 22,000 cases of wine. Dressel says that the wine industry is an important part of Missouri's economy. Most state wineries are huge tourist attractions and therefore benefit many industries. He says tourist dollars spent at a winery go to a lot of different places. So when people come out to the winery, not only are they buying wine, but they're also buying uh, foodstuffs that are coming from food vendors. They're buying flowers for weddings, cakes uh, from a bakery. It's a pretty widespread industry. Missouri tax incentives are a major benefit to wineries. The incentives aid wineries just starting up or expanding operations. Mount Pleasant used many of the incentives to get to the size it is today. It, we wouldn't have been able to do it without those incentives. If you're looking to sample the wine the drought has produced, you are in luck. The unseasonably warm winter forced wineries to harvest its grapes early this year. Mount Pleasant plans to release its first bottles of the season early, starting in March of next year. Dressel is optimistic that the wine industry in Missouri will continue to expand, but he extends his sympathy to farmers who did not benefit so well from the drought. 